Over his 28-year coaching career, Woody Hayes cemented the Ohio State University's tradition of football excellence while amassing one of the most impressive records in college football. Wayne Woodrow, Woody Hayes, grew up in Newcomerstown, Ohio and graduated from Denison University in 1935. Hayes began his coaching career soon after as both an assistant and head coach at two different Ohio high schools. Despite his early success as a coach, Achieving an 18-11-1 record overall, it wasn't long before he eventually decided to enlist in the United States Navy in 1941. Through his grit and determination, Woody Hayes quickly climbed the ladder and achieved the rank of Lieutenant Commander during World War II. As the war was nearing its end, the then-suspended Denison University football program was looking for a fresh start. Denison initially reached out to former head coach Thomas Rogers to lead their program once again. Rogers ultimately decided to decline the offer, opening the door for Denison University to offer the job to none other than Woody Hayes. During his inaugural season as the Denison football head coach, Hayes struggled to lead the team to victory, racking up only two wins in the first season. However, he would quickly turn that around, winning 19 consecutive games. And people were watching. This period of success drew the interest of Miami University, which offered Hayes his next head coaching job. And then finally, in 1951, Hayes accepted the job that he is most known for today as the head coach at THE Ohio State University. But this was not without controversy. Hayes beat out much more established and qualified candidates, one of which being eventual Hall of Fame coach and Ohio native Paul Brown. Despite the naysayers, this decision would prove to be an excellent one for the Buckeyes. Under Coach Hayes' leadership, the team would go on to win 205 games, 13 Big Ten titles, and five national championships. Hayes was as passionate as they come and trademarked his three yards and a cloud of dust running offense. In recognition of his many years of service to the sport, Hayes was inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame in 1983. And unfortunately, just a few years following his induction into the College Football Hall of Fame, Hayes would pass away, leaving behind his legacy of excellency on and off the field. A true Ohio legend. <laughs>